Hi Water Signs, Pisces, Cancer, and Scorpio. Welcome to my channel. My name is Chelsea. In this reading, we're going to find out what's coming up for you within 24 hours. And for those of you who like to book a personal reading with me, information is in the description box below. Today is the 16th of January, 2023. Time here in Bali, Indonesia is 4.10 p.m. And please bear in mind that this is a collective reading for water signs. And if you were to finally guided to watch this video, this message is meant for you, even if you're dealing with the same water sign. Now let's get your reading started. And I hope you don't mind the background noise. I'm actually outside. Um, I just had my lunch. I'm at a restaurant right now. I just thought, you know, to give it, <laughs> give it a try, just being outside and reading just for a change. But anyway, Let's get our reading started. Spirits and angels, please show me for water signs, Pisces, Cancer, and Scorpio. What's coming up for water signs within 24 hours? Sun in reverse at the bottom of the deck. Okay, so um, hmm. please bear in mind that there are a lot of details in this reading. It's not going to apply to you for from the beginning to the end. And also, even though this prediction is for within 24 hours, but it could be, it could go longer than that. It could go longer than that. Sorry, <laughs> I'm getting distracted by all the noise. I hope you're okay. I hope you uh, you can hear me clearly. Um, Put it in the comment box below if you can't hear me, okay? So that maybe next time I won't do this again. Or maybe I'll go to a different place that's less noisy. But a few different versions that I'm seeing here in terms of the Queen of Wands, the Cherry, and the Seven of Cups. Some of you within 24 hours or so, you're going to buy a car. Trying to choose between buying a car or a bike. Or could be going on um, shopping feels like a choice you're gonna make a very important choice um, because charity is a major kind so well it depends it's very subjective right what's important to one person may not be important to another but what I'm sensing here is that you're going to make a decision in regards of purchasing something or it could be where you're gonna travel because the charity is a form of transportation or who you're gonna choose when it comes to love um, but unless roles are being reversed here, what are signs that, especially if you're dealing with a fire sign, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo, Cancer, then this person could be thinking about ways to get to you, to see you, to travel towards you. Unless you do know that you are in a third party situation, then this person may be thinking about who to choose between you and the rest of the other options that he or she may have, okay? Then we've got the King of Swords here in reverse and we've got the Queen of Swords. Yeah, again, for those of you in a third party situation, I feel like somebody, could be you, your person, or the third party, could be deliberating whether to continue with this connection or to completely forget about it, okay? That's for some of you if you are involved in a third party situation. We've got the Empress in reverse and also we've got the Nine of Cups. For some of you, um, some of you, not all of you. You might go and visit somebody who may be kind of ill or bedridden. Um, someone who can't quite do something for themselves. It feels like they, they could be bed, bedridden because of the Nine of Cups, like I can't move. Kind of an energy, an empress here in reverse. I would like to move, but I can't. So I don't know. This is just for some of you. Or somebody will be traveling towards you or bring you food or drinks because cups can indicate that if you are not feeling well or if you can't get out of your bed or can't get out of your, out of your house I see someone moving towards you um, coming to visit you or bring you something food or drinks but it could also be an indication of some sort of a document because got the will of fortune here this is just for very small 
portion of you what a signs it could have something to do with some sort of a news that you've been waiting for and that you've been hoping for I see you um, receiving some good news because of the will of fortune here hmm <laughs> you know what else that I'm seeing right now if you're in a casino you know I don't I don't uh, encourage gambling because I have a cousin who has a gambling problem and he he devastated the whole family I mean long story short but I don't encourage gambling but you know for fun once in a while it's fine but for those of you if you're gambling if you're in Vegas just for fun or wherever you're at casino I see you like you could be winning some money but not a lot okay but not a lot <laughs> just a little bit because of the Knight of Pentacles and Movers. The Sun Cups here kind of makes me feel like uh, you will win some and then you lose some and then you will win some and then you will lose some. Something like that. It eventually possibly going to come back kind of even or even if you were to uh, win some money it would be just a little bit. If you were to lose some money it's just a little bit. But yeah, that's what I'm seeing here. And the Chariot, you know again some sort of movement you could be getting ready to go on um, to travel, Sun of Cups, thinking of what else to pack. And I see you feeling really excited with the Queen of Wands here, unless someone is very excited to pack, to leave, and to see you, to come see you, okay? That's for some of you. I see you taking a break, a little bit of a break when it comes to work, or some of you may take a break to take somebody around, like, you know, I don't know, to entertain somebody, take somebody, go shopping. I see you taking a break, yeah? No matter, I, I think it could be a short break or it could be a long break if you're traveling. Let's pull out a few more cards here. I really hope you can hear me. <laughs> but um, the sun here is in reverse. Yeah, you know what? Not such a good idea to gamble. Yeah, with the sun in reverse. You may lose a little bit, but even if you two were to win a little bit, it's going to be just a little bit. And it's going to make you feel a bit confused here. Seven of Cups. I feel like it's going to be up and down. Queen of Pentacles. And then we've got the Nine of Pentacles here. For those of you, I feel like you're going to be a little bit confused. Within 24 hours or so. In regards of your money. In regards of your uh, career. If you should continue working at the same place or if you should strike out on your own with the Nine of Pentacles here, okay? But for some of you, this could be that Virgo Capricorn Taurus energy and individual where I feel, I feel like, you know, the Wheel of Fortune can indicate a second chance so this person may ask for a second chance. Some of you could be in a same gender relationship, not all of you. Unless you're embodying all three, three queens here, which is the Queen of Pentacles, Queen of Wands, and the Queen of Swords. Some of you are going to be multitasking. That's what I'm seeing. Seven of Cups, multitasking between, <laughs> could be shopping, working, you know, doing something that you're passionate about, but also studying or learning something new. I see you doing a lot of things, actually, within 24 hours or so. Again, it could be related to work, travels, studies learning something new may have something to do with your finances your business your career again some of you are going to be traveling solo packing getting ready to travel solo or you could be already traveling solo on your own and you may be thinking about your finances how it's going to be i see you um managing your finances as well you're going to be drinking, eating something new today or within 24 hours or, or so. Um, someone may introduce you to something new, a new type of cuisine. Or you're going to be drinking a lot, nine of cups, or try something, a new drink. You see, you got the nine of cups and the nine of pentacles here. Some of you, you're going to tell everybody, you know, stay out of my way. I'm going to do my own thing. <laughs> stay
stay out of my way whatever that makes you feel good nine of cups whatever that you're indulging in some of you could be indulging in just cruising online i mean you know um going online my mom is pisces she loves you know reading all sorts, sorts of news and everything <laughs> online some of you could be doing that or you could be drinking and eating and just doing your own thing i see you doing your own thing water signs within 24 hours or so i see you are gonna be you know if you do anything at all it will be you just uh, moving about whether it's shopping or driving the, a car or meeting someone if there's anybody it's just one person though but i see most of you gonna stay at home focus on your work or whatever that makes you happy whether it's watching netflix or you know going online or eating drinking <laughs> Will fortune can indicate something online as well. Hmm. You don't see the sun, the sun in reverse, that means you don't get out of your house. Some of you are not gonna get out of your house, you're gonna stay home. Some of you may change your mind thinking that I'm gonna go out, but then you change your mind and you're just gonna stay home. And then you're gonna be chatting with somebody, Page of Pentacles here, a friend. But yeah, I see two different groups of you. 50% of you are going to be out and about traveling or shopping or trying to choose something, buy something. Some of you are going to be working with Queen of Pentacles here. A lot of you are going to be staying at home, tending to your own needs or indulging in whatever that, again, makes you happy. All right, what are signs, Pisces, Cancer, and Scorpio? This is your reading. Hope you resonated in some way, shape, or form. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. I'm going to leave you with uh, two playlists on the screen right now. The first one it, uh, is titled Daily Readings. For this uh, playlist, it has all of the readings that I've done for you and for the rest of the signs with different topics and different questions. But these readings are very up-to-date because I post them every single day, even twice a day sometimes. And another playlist is it's titled Asia. This playlist is from my second channel. It has all of the um, all of the vlogs, the vlogs, travel vlogs. <laughs> Check them out too if you want to take care of all the signs. I hope to see you back here again later tomorrow. Bye.